Here in the program, we toured a beekeeping operation four miles east of Beatrice called Bee Bum. They use the wax and honey from 300 honeybee colonies to make their products. In this segment, Grace McDonald tastes some of these honeys near Beatrice. Hi, I'm Grace McDonald with Pure Nebraska, and today I'm four miles east of Beatrice at the site of Bee Bum with Julie Monfelt. How are you doing, Julie? I'm good. How are you, Grace? I'm doing really well. It's a beautiful day, and it I'm is. excited to try what you have laid out here. So Got what it. do you have here for us today? So we make several different honey products in addition to raw honey that we have from our hives. We make creamed honey and infused honey, and we sell them at farmer's markets and craft shows and that kind of thing. So today we have for you three of our best-selling um, creamed honeys. We have our cinnamon, strawberry, and blueberry. All right. So creamed honeys are spreadable. You can put it on English muffin, bagel, toast, pancakes, waffles. All right. Go for it. You said cinnamon, cinnamon is your best one? Yes. Okay. So yeah, the cinnamon is our best seller. I put it in my chai tea as a natural sweetener too. Some people put it in their coffee instead of creamer. And it's just honey and a Vietnamese cinnamon that we get from a spice shop in Lincoln. And it's a process we put it through to make it creamy like that. And they say it doesn't even taste like honey. It tastes more like frosting mm -hmm. or... That's a better way to put mm -hmm. it. That was really good. Thanks. Should we move on? Sure. To which one is this one? So that again? one is the strawberry. Okay. I'm a strawberry fan. Are you? So it's, like I said, honey and freeze-dried strawberries. It can be mixed. We've mixed three ounces of the cream honey with a block of cream cheese, and it makes a good fruit dip for strawberries or apples or pears. Super sweet. Much sweeter than the cinnamon, than the cinnamon. obviously. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I could see you dipping fruit in there, too, for people who really had that sweet tooth. But. Yeah, right. And so the last one that we have of the cream honey is blueberry. We do have 12 different flavors. I think you can see them back here um, that we produce. There's so many different flavors too, mm -hmm. like chocolate, key lime, those are peanut butter. Those are very unique flavors yeah. too. The garlic has become one of our best sellers in our infused honeys because you can use it in so many different ways. Um, I put it on pizza, pulled pork sandwiches, brisket, um, Bailey puts it on her mac and cheese. I like it. It'd be great for savory stuff mm -hmm, just mm -hmm. to put it on there and sweeten it up a little bit. So, yep. wow. And then this is our hot one. So this is one of our hot ones. We All have right. chili, mango chili, peach habanero, and pineapple ghost pepper. So this is the chili infused one. All right. What do you put on, what do you so, use this for? So wings, ribs, brisket, pulled pork. How can people try out or buy your products? So we do farmer's markets and shows, and those are listed on our Facebook page. Uh, we do the Beatrice Farmer's Market now once a week. Um, we also do have a website as well that people can order stuff online. Um, we don't like to ship the creamed honey during the summer because it gets hot and you don't know how long it's going to sit in a storage facility. So, Or they can come here to the to the um, farm. Um, just let us know in advance that they want to come out. All right. Well, thanks for letting me come out here today. I appreciate you it. You're very welcome.